All right, I'm gonna try something I've never tried before. We've got a real-time video here of the planet Uranus. Yes, sir, folks, planet Uranus. That's uh, the planet between Saturn and Neptune, visible here. Got it through Mute, Takashi Mulan 250 telescope with a 2x bar low, We're running at f24, magnification's 240 power, and we are using a Gen 3 unfilmed white phosphor image intensifier. Uh, and a Sony, I'm sorry, a Panasonic GH3 camera on the back end, which is set to 1 40th of a second shutter, ISO is 3200, and a Litton 1 to 1 relay lens. So, what do we got here? That bright blob in the middle is the overexposed disk of the planet Uranus, and then there's some dimmer dots near it. If you look to just below the planet, Roughly at 6 o'clock position, really close, almost touching the thing, although it's not really as close. It's because it's overexposed that the disk is larger than it should be, but that f dot just below, that would be the moon Ariel. And then below it, a little bit lower, further out, is the moon Titania. Titania. If you look off to the left, the 9 o'clock position, left of the planet, 9 o'clock position, is the moon Oberon. And you can just barely make out, I think, the moon Umbriel, which is at roughly the 10, 11 o'clock position, nearly touching the planet at the 11 o'clock position. Can you see that? It's dimmer than the other moons. I think that's there. But anyway, that's the planet Uranus through a night vision image intensifier in more or less real time, 40 frames a second. Kind of cool, huh? Well, I guess for kicks, if I wanted to, I'm going to jack up my shutter speed really high and see if we can shrink down the planet disk. So we're at a 40th, so let's go way up to like, so, well, if it's 4,000, that's probably too much. Let's go back to like 2,000. I don't know if this is the actual disk size of Uranus or not. It's 1,300. It's 1 1,300th of a second shutter. If I keep going, there's 800. 500, 400, 320th, the 250th, and as I get a gradually longer shutter speed, the moons start to appear, right? Let me back up back to a 40th right there. So that is the planet Uranus. Jeez, I almost said Neptune. And it's currently in the constellation of uh, Pisces, magnitude 5.7, distance 19 astronomical units. That puts it at uh, see, 158 light minutes away. Hmm. Cool. So the light we're seeing here is 158 minutes old. On the evening of October 10th, 11th, 2015. And uh, we'll call that a wrap. So, hello Uranus.